Hey guys, it is Monday, January 9th, 2011, and I think the high today was about 65. I just got back from tutoring. Um, I'm down to only two kids that I'm tutoring, and of course they're like on opposite days, so I'm having to go every day anyway. Um, but I'm almost done with them. This is the last week for them, and then I don't know what happens after that. I don't know if I get more kids or if I'm just done for the school year. I guess I'll find out after this week. Um, but because they're both my later kids, I have like this big gap in between my work day, regular work day, and then the tutoring now. Like I have two and a half hours instead of one hour in between and um, it's nice because I don't have to rush to get ready but then it's also not nice because I come home and I'm like getting all settled and I'm like oh I don't want to go out again but uh yeah one more week and then I'll figure out what my schedule is for next time but yeah uh last week was working we went back to work on Tuesday um I was a little bit excited <laughs> but also very tired like I was very tired all week um I didn't really do anything that exciting I was just working. I had dance practice on Wednesday for my kids, my fifth graders, and then my dance class on Wednesday and Thursday. And then um, Saturday, of course, this weekend. Saturday, nothing. No plans at all. Sunday, there were like three things I wanted to do. I could only do one of them, and I had already committed to going to um, a dance workshop fundraiser for um, our dancing event that's in March. So I went to that. It was over in Victorville at the old dance studio that I used to dance at when I was a kid because that's where I used to live. It was three hours and there was different classes every hour, like three different classes each hour. I think you had to choose which one to go to. So I learned Argentine tango, which was interesting. It's a very like up close dance. Like you have to like put your arm around the dude. Like we did practice stuff first, but then that part and I was like, well, that's weird. And also like it doesn't go to a set timing or a set rhythm. Like, the, there's steps that you're supposed to do, but you can do them as fast or as slow as you want to. Like, that's weird to me. I like rhythm and, like, knowing when I'm supposed to do things. So that was interesting. I had never done it before, so I decided to try that. And then I did West Coast Swing for the next two hours because I'm like, I know how to do that. Uh, so that was Sunday. And then I had carpooled over with people, even though I kind of just wanted to drive myself so I could leave whenever I wanted. And then so we ended up going to dinner at John's Incredible Pizza because we had my friend's kids with us and they wanted to go there. And uh, so I didn't get home until fairly late-ish, later than I would have liked maybe. And uh, yeah, today was working. I did a dance practice for my fifth graders. It's going okay. Some of them, okay. <laughs> some of them have some good rhythm. Other ones do not. Um, and then I came home and did a couple things and then went and tutored and just got back. Yeah. And in my head right now, I have like a million sight word songs. Uh, we're big into sight words right now, which is being the kids being able to read words um, without having to sound them out because a lot of them you can't sound out because our language is weird. Um, so like, I have so many random words in my head right now, but mostly the song for go because that's our new word. We're doing one, the one word that comes with the curriculum, plus we're doing five other words, but that's our one word. And, um, I say, like, I, sh I sang the song for the kids in the morning, and then all day, all they did was sing this song all around randomly. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so stuck in my head. And it goes like, um, geo, 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 I can spell a go, 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 geo, 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 go, 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 go to school. So that's just running on a loop in my head right now. So, <laughs> Elena and Sarah, it was nice to see your videos and hear your bucket list. Uh, your lists were much more put together than mine. Uh, Sarah, congratulations on the job. I hope it's a good move and that you have a good time and everything goes well. And yeah, yeah. Hope your weeks are going to go well. And Elena, I will see you on Wednesday. Sarah, I will see you on Friday. Oh, and I'll put the challenge in the chat. So sometime this week, you'll get it whenever we're all online. All right, bye.